Hi guys, Fellow here from Blackfield YouTube channel and today really really short episode and comparison about two Joby Gorilla Pods. The 3K Pro one kit and then 3K kit. This one is plastic. This one is aluminium. So the cheaper one, the Gorilla Pod 3K kit with flexible light weight tripod with ball head for DSLR cameras. It's fairly good, it's certainly well for more or less a year. However, they do tend to have tendency to crack and this, this quick release thing is good for your phone when you put a, a phone holder here or really small compact camera, but not, in my opinion, not for a heavy one, like mirrorless or DSLR. And these legs are after time, they're so wobbly, so wobbly and it's so easy to, they just, because they do crack here, I don't know if you can see that, but in quite a few joints, they've cracked. So it's fine and fairly lightweight when you do vlogging with your phone and stuff, and, and this is quite decent. And recently, as a birthday gift, I received this one, the Gorilla Pot 3K Pro kit. And this is aluminium, much more sturdy. Much, much more sturdy and everything is just better. The, the quality is better. And the ball head here is equipped with Arca Swiss compatible plate, which is mounted on, uh, on the camera just now, well, underneath the camera, which I use the tripod for and the tripod plate is actually here i can use the one from this this gorilla pot free kit and this one is much more sturdier and it's quite difficult to fold it or anything but because of that when you actually use your heavier heavier camera it is really stable and i used that quite recently in torquay English Riviera down south in England on the English coast and I'm gonna put that video just now because I put it on the on the pier I've trusted it 100% with my camera. I can't say the same with the 3k kit It is just Take a look at it. It won't hold anything which is quite heavy. It just won't. It was good for a couple of weeks then a couple of cracks appeared on a couple of joints and since then it's not been trustworthy so and the ball head is really good so i will keep the ball head but i'll do something with this later on maybe i'll give it to someone who uses it use a phone for for uh, vlogging or something like that but definitely this bit and then you have the pin which prevents the camera mounted on the on the plate from falling off this you actually need to raise it slightly on the one side and slide it out so much much better and this one at the moment costs 99 pounds on amazon and the cheaper one is at the moment is 62 pounds on amazon i'm gonna leave affiliate links underneath the video so you can check them out uh, but yeah honestly i would definitely recommend the the more expensive one you will only buy it once I bought this one a year ago when I started vlogging and it was fine when I used to vlog with my phone and with the 20 millimeters f1.8 G lens from Sony. But whenever I put um, the Sigma 24 to 17 millimeter lens f2.8 on this one, there's always, there was always something wrong. It started to fold and uh, actually the camera actually went down twice. Thankfully nothing happened because obviously, as you can see, the height is, uh, is not really great. So it just fell on the, on the side. So it wasn't too bad, but never had any issues for a month. Uh, so yeah, definitely. And this option to actually have ball head as well in any direction, great. And this is, I think it's slightly heavier, the aluminum one, but the legs are thinner as you can see. So my recommendation, pay slightly, slightly more for the Pro one. 
as you won't regret it and it will last longer that's my that's my short that's my short opinion about these two so uh, once again thanks for watching i uh, hope you enjoyed a really short episode on my youtube channel if yes uh, drop it a like and a thumbs up um, if you have any questions just leave them in the section uh, down below the video and remember to subscribe to my youtube channel and the last thing Remember that the sponsor of this channel is 365vibesstore.com so follow the link in the description or go to bigphilonline.com and follow the link from that website and sign up for a free raffle and you may win a t-shirt or a mug so definitely be a participant in that raffle that's all for today thanks for watching and see you in the next one cheers